In this video, as y'all read from the title, I'm, ugh, why he gotta always cry? Every time I wanna do an intro, Prince wanna start crying. But I'm gonna redo my bathroom. As y'all can see, I took mostly everything out. This is how we looking. I took everything. I put everything that was in the tub in this little basket. I don't know why I band-aid right here. <laughs> I got the paint up here. Everything. Um, I'm about to take this curtain down. I'm going to take this curtain down, take this out of here. Just all the stuff set for the cleaning and the pink stuff. I'm going to just take it out. And I'm going to start spraying this down. But before we get started, I'm about to put something on that I don't really care about. Because it seems like every time I clean up, I get bleach things on me. But yeah, I'll be right back. And y'all, I look tired as hell. I change into something that I don't really care about. But before I get started, I'm going to tell y'all what I'm going to be changing. So first, this is going to be like a two video process. This is part one because I ordered some stuff and it didn't come yet. So these lights got to go. They look disgusting. And then I bought some border tape to go around here because it looked crazy. Like I feel like it looked better. It's black border tape. I don't know if y'all ever seen it before. Um, These walls are like a yellow color. Don't like them. I'm painting them white and as y'all can see it look a little dingy. We cannot have that. That is that's not mm -mm. and then I ordered another shower head that's gonna be here. So that's probably gonna be in part two. But for for today's video, I'm just gonna um oh also the bottom of this little thing down here. I bought these little things because it look raggedy, y'all. I I really don't like when stuff look raggedy. It made me it made me feel like I'm dirty. But I bought these to go at the bottom so it could look so much better because y'all, it looks ratchet. This is how it looks. Y'all see how that look down there? I'm going to put some of this down there as well, but it just look dirty. Like I'm going to clean it before I put this down there. So those are the things that we're doing in this video. Cleaning. First, I'm going to clean. Then after I clean, I'm going to do the, put the, what is this stuff called? Vinyl? Yes, a vinyl. I'm going to put the vinyl in the dresser, and then after I do the vinyls, I'm going to paint. So, yeah, let's get it right into it. So, y'all, and I also wanted to tell y'all the colors that I'm doing about them. There, it's going to be, originally, I was going to do gray, gray, wait, gray, black, and white. But, I added beige because if you look in here, this is kind of like a beige color, and I didn't want it to, like, throw it off so it's like i'll just add a little beige in there but yeah it's not as yellow as this right here but i added a little beige just so this wouldn't throw the bathroom off so i'm gonna season this tub real quick with a whole bunch of different um cleaning products y'all i know you're not supposed to mix chemicals but i've been doing this for a while so don't worry about me i'm okay i'm okay i'll see this on my shorts it is not nothing i just i was painting my room purple and it got on my pants, so if you see it, that's what it is. Perfect paint. So y'all, 
Now that I'm done cleaning out the tub, tub look good, y'all. I did that. I freaking did that. Yeah, I've been using so many chemicals, my nose stuffy. And I look at the toilet. Toilet. Let me show y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all a good hack on cleaning up the toilet. So leave. When I oh y'all can see me. When I clean the toilet, I don't like to um use a rag and then have to wipe it down and then squeeze it and then touch in what was on the toilet. I don't like to do that. So I just use napkins and once I wipe it, I fold it and I wipe it in and I throw it in the trash. So I don't have to touch what was on the toilet. Yes, I can wear gloves, but that's just how I like clean it. And I feel like I clean it better. And it's like, you know how when you clean it with a rag and it be hair just coming back and forth. When you do it with a napkin, you don't see hair everywhere. But yeah, that's what works for me. If you never tried it before, you should try it. It really, really works. But now what I'm about to do is um, put these vinyl things in here and up under there. I think I'm going to do these first and then I'm going to start with that one. I'm going to do that one off camera because y'all look at this. It's going to be a little bit more difficult for me to get to it. But I'm going to do this one off camera and I'm going to do those on camera. So yeah, let me do this. And then I'll come back. It looks so much better. Like, look at this one compared to the bottom of that. Like, that's just not it. But what I realized was these aren't sticky. But that's fine. I'm going to still use them. But I do want to get the sticky ones for up under there because I'm going to do this one. I'm going to let y'all see me do this one really quickly. Which it wasn't that hard at all because it doesn't stick. But I'll show y'all what I'm doing. much better oh my god that just that just looks compared to this oh my god this looks this is give it it just spices up it just looks nice so i'm gonna put the stuff right here i can't even explain it but it looks good So y'all, this, this right here is exactly why I wanted to put it down because it's like damaged and they have like stuff around it. But for this one, I don't really know how I'm going to do it because this is like a drawer. So, you know, it kind of, I think I'm going to have to like put tape at the bottom of it so I can stay. I really thought these were the sticky ones, but I'm going to see, I'm going to experiment. I'm going to wipe this out really quick, take all the stuff and I'm going to see how it does. So yeah, I cleaned it out. It looks so much better. It still doesn't look cute, but it looks better than it did. Now I'm finna put down my little things. Oh yeah, I'm tired. These little things right here. But I think it's gonna be like a little too small, but that's gonna be okay because as long as it cover majority of it, I'm fine. So I'm gonna put this down real quickly. So y'all. This is what I did. So basically, I just put two on top of each other. So it can be some over here because I honestly hate how the bottom of this thing looks. But I'm going to do that one over there. And I'm going to be done for tonight because I'm tired. And it's like 1 o'clock in the morning. So I'll see y'all tomorrow when I get ready to paint. And I need to take me a shower. I'm going to go take a shower for my sister bathroom. Because as you can see, our curtain is done. But yeah. But yeah, this is how it looks. So I ordered one of these things right here. I'm going to put it right here. I think when it comes, I'm going to put it more on this side. So y'all don't be able to tell that there's two of them. But this looks much better than that. Like, do y'all see the difference? This looks better. And like, the bottom of this thing looks better. Like, just looking through the containers and I have clear containers, it looks so much better. But, yeah. So y'all, I know I look crazy. Like me doing this whole process, I'm gonna look crazy. So just ignore it. But y'all, I ordered some stick and peel um, paper for my counter and my cabinets. But I was trying to like see how long it was. So y'all, look how I measured this thing. I use pictures because y'all know the pictures are like 
four by six. So I usually, I use the pictures to figure out what I need, what size I need in order to order my papers. But yeah, um, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna do this off camera, but I'm gonna tell y'all what I'm about to do. So I'm just gonna put tape all around like this, the edge of this hub and I'll put like, I don't have like the, um, I don't have the tape that you use, not the tape, but the little plastic paper that you use. So I like to put tape like on the floor just so when I start painting it don't like drip because I'm painting the whole wall is going to be white but I don't want when I paint down here for the paint to get on the floor if y'all understand what I'm saying. So I'm going to do that really quickly then once I do that I'm going to change my clothes and then we're going to get to painting y'all because yesterday I could not do it because I had a migraine. It's still kind of there but it's like I got to get it done like I got to, I got to get it. So yeah I changed my clothes and I put the tape on the tub I think I'm going to do this part of the bathroom first and the roof because those are like the most difficult parts so i'm gonna do this part the roof and then i'm gonna do like around the toilet because i know that's gonna be a little difficult so those are the things that i want to do first so yeah let me get my stand so y'all can watch me Stranger, it's been a minute since we last kissed. And by the way, just got in town, and I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky ruin my vibe. And usually, I don't do this often, but since recruiting isn't an option. Use you on use your rain and thunder Baby, I wonder Baby, I wonder Would you just put your sweats on Put your sweats on for me yeah. I got the plug, I made the call for me mm -hmm. I'm late night for ya Let me lay the bed down So you all I did this part, I did it twice. I'm gonna let this dry and I'm gonna go to Big Lots to see if I can find a, another curtain lot because the one I just took down just broke. So I gotta find another one to put up here while we gonna let this dry. This is done, I'm not going over it. I already went over it two coats. Only thing I might do is just go over the edges one more time and then that part will be done. So see look y'all, just look at that. And then you got this nasty ass yellow wall. Y'all just see the difference, like it just make it look more I don't know, but I'm finna go to Big Lots, so I'll be back. Oh, I look crazy. Oh my god, a little ratchet pumpkin on this camera for these people. That's fine though. But y'all, this is the um, I went to Walmart and I got this little shower rod. It curves and it's like a bronze color, but we're not gonna put this up right now. But I did repaint, I just got finished repainting this one, it looks so much better. Like, look at that little corner. We're not gonna paint this over here so y'all enjoy. Don't hesitate, no, don't you? Just say you will, will, will come through and share. Oh, hell no! Because, baby, I was not trying to 
be sick from fumes and toxins in my body. So I stepped out for like an hour. But I'm gonna show y'all what I've done because I did a little bit off camera, but hold on. Still, this wall is completely finished. Finish, but I still have to redo this wall. I only did this wall one time, as you can see, one time. But I did the roof over here. Let me come this way. <clears throat> I painted the roof. I need to paint it one more time because as y'all can see, y'all can see like the little lines. But I need to paint this. I'm not gonna paint this until I clear out the counter. But y'all see these little dots? Those were for my Christmas lights. So this, if you got Christmas lights on your wall, take them down because this will happen. But yeah. So I'm gonna finish this side right here of camera and the roof and then I'm gonna come back when I'm about to do the mirror. On the net, nigga, I thought you was a thug. I ain't got nowhere to go. I shot up everywhere they would. Yeah, you know who took this shit from you? Come get it back in blood. Brr, brr, bitch, come get it back in blood. We ain't mask up, no Dodger Rigs. Niggas know who it was. They store shit just like the 80s. Want some back? Get it in blood. Yeah, you know who took this shit from you? Come get it back in blood. If your nigga killer ain't dead, you should wear no RP. So we had 300 shots up in the car before we picked up dirt. You niggas who ain't Got she going, go grab a glizzy, get alert. Shots to G post RP, I have a reason he in the dirt. Slime, brr, you gotta know I go too far. Got two O's up on this honey, one of them might stand for O block. About 20 some shots left up in the K, 15 still in the block. Glee my door lock and stop, I lock, get no feet park the car. Brr, get no clothes doing dirty, I ain't showing sure love. 11,000 all one, let my right pocket in the club. Your face is up on me dirty, I went got it out the room. So as y'all can see, don't worry about this. This can come off with soap and water, so I'm not worried about it on my floor. But as y'all can see, I took the toilet paper thing off. And those drips are not for me. Those are for whoever previously painted, because baby, I know how to paint. Don't get twisted. But I took these two things off, but I didn't I wasn't sure if I wanted to like take these off the wall. I really just wanted to like paint around it but i might have to paint, save a little paint for like when i get stuff because i don't know if it'll require one of these or i'll have to take it off so i'm gonna just save a little paint same for those that's why i kept those up so i'm gonna just keep those two up till my stuff comes on tuesday i think and i'm gonna keep these up just in case i was about to take it out but i'm like something telling me to keep it up until my stuff comes and i did get some more of these so i'm gonna take these out and like paint around it you know make it clean or whatever yes I'm so crazy right now so this part right here i'm basically painting the little things because they were the same color as the wall they were that yellow color and i didn't want to get my new socket covers and the switches be yellow and the wall be white and it just throw it off so It's your boy, Young. You ready? Okay, y'all. I am finished for tonight. Um, really, I'm finished. Tomorrow, the only thing that I'm going to be doing is putting up the curtain rod because I have to wait for the other stuff to come. So, when my other stuff comes, I'll get started, y'all. But the very the last thing that I'm doing is the floor. So, I'm, I'm going to get some sticking peel on the floor yeah don't worry about this it comes off with soap and water really easy to come off but um i'm gonna get sticking pill for the floor but that's gonna be later on like when i'm done with everything but um i'm about to go to bed y'all it is look what time it is in the morning 4 25. i painted this bathroom in one day one day and it looks amazing like Look at the difference from when I first started to now. Like, it looks 
We just gotta change out the yellow lights. Sweet. But yeah. So the last thing that I'm going to be doing is putting up this curved shower rod that I got from Walmart. I will be linking everything that I use down in the description box below. But if you do decide to go with this one, it is a two-person job, y'all. And it's a, like, when I put it on, it is very, 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 very sturdy. It's a really, really good curtain rod. But um, this is going to be part one of this video. Part two, I'm going to be doing a stick and peel floors in the bathroom. I'm going to be doing a vinyl cab um counters and cabinets. So y'all stay tuned for that. So crazy right now. I look this stuff so deep in your eyes. I touch on you more and more every time. When you leave, I'm begging you not to go. Call your name two, three times in a row. Such a funny thing for me to try to explain. How I'm feeling in my pride is the one to blame. Yeah. Cause I know I don't understand. Just how you love can do it. No one else can. Come and look so crazy right now. Your love's coming look so crazy right now. I did it all by myself, as y'all see. Yeah. <laughs> you might as well say she did because she didn't call for me. I don't know why. It looks so much. Oh my god, I can't Thank wait till I finish. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this liner on here until I, my curtain come because I don't want to put the old white one that was on there. I might wash it and bleach it and put it back on there just for the time being. But oh my god, y'all, I can't finish. I can't wait to finish. Why are you smiling? Thanks for helping me. You already told me they're out of work. <laughs> no, you helped me. Cause I couldn't I wouldn't be able to get that up by myself. But you did it. Well you did most of it. You should have called me. Oh, let me take the tape. Record me take it. Oh, you could tape it off. But when you take it off, make sure you like push this because when I was taking it off earlier, this happened. So yeah, this is how it looks without the tape. I'll show y'all when I get the curtain. But I'm gonna take this little tape off right here. Off the mirror. So y'all, um, this is gonna be like uh part one of this video. Yeah, I did get my teeth pulled out on the sides. So um that's gonna be a separate video, but I'm gonna do the part two because all my stuff hasn't come. So in part two of that video, I'm just gonna be doing a vinyl stick and peel floors, like I said. Um, I'm going to be changing out this vanity, um, the sockets and stuff. And yeah, and I'm going to do the vinyl stick and peel for the cabinets and the counter. But yeah, I can't really talk right now. So, whenever all my stuff come, I'm going to do like a voiceover of me doing everything. Because I talk funny and I keep like, it's weird. But yeah, to be continued.